Hi guys, how are you doing? So today we're going to take a look at the Asus Royo 240. Um, it's going to a mini ITX build, which I'm doing, which is the Fractal Design Nano S. We're going to unbox it, we're going to install it, I'm going to do some temperature testing. Um, so let's, uh, let's go do it. Right guys, so here's the, uh, the box for the uh, ROG Royo 240. Uh, it's not actually a brand new one, it's um, one which I've got from eBay, got a really good deal. The guy was doing a custom loop, so put it in an auction, I just bid it at the last second and I got it, so I'm very happy. The, the packaging is so nice from ASUS, I do like the, uh, the last couple of years, they put a lot of effort into it, it's very premium looking and yeah, it just stands out, just, just a little bit ahead of the, uh, the crowd. And to be honest, you are paying a little bit more as well with ASUS, so it's, uh, it's to be expected. So if we open it up, have a look inside. So we've got the, uh, the two fans there. These are pretty decent. Um, when I do some testing, I'm gonna use my favorite Arctic P12 PWM fans, and I'm gonna compare them against these and, uh, and see which one's uh, which better, because actually I don't know. So, uh, so that'd be quite interesting. We have the old USB cable. So obviously that controls um, the lighting and the like. Um, with this um, cooler, it's very nice because um, you can program this um, so it displays you know, your CPU temperature and the like. And then we've got all the... Nice. And seeing as we're doing a Ryzen build, we've got the, uh, the plate on there already. So that's, uh, that's good. So if we just get it out, move the box out of the way. Okay, so if you just look at the cables, we have um, for the fans, we've got two fans there which we can connect. We've got the SATA for the power, and then we've got the uh, for the CPU header. It's a, it's a very standard kind of radiator, same, same sort of thing you'll get from Corsair um, and other, other brands, NZXT as well. It's, it's essentially the same. Ace Tech pump. Um, I'm expecting good things from this, to be honest. So, um, so hopefully it won't disappoint.
First off, the fans with this cooler are really, really good. Now, if, you, you know, if you're gonna run them at 100%, not so good, you know, the cooling's great, but the noise level is just, yeah, it, it's deafening almost. Um, now, usually with, with, um, usually with stock fans, you know, I, I kind of don't even bother. I'll put Arctic P12s, and I also tested those, as you saw from the results. Now, they do run at a lower RPM, but they're a good option. Um, a very good option to be honest also from the results you saw that i ran everything 100 percent and it was well under the turbo level um, of the of the rog fans but it all depends on your use case really um, are you going to use this cooler in an atx a mini itx um, a micro atx you know what, what case fans are you going to have so it all depends on what your tolerance levels are for heat and for noise, um, obviously, ultimately, is, is how you're going to run them and you know what fans you're going to use. But if you're going to use the sock fans, you know, you're not going to have too many problems, to be honest. So one of the things that this fan has also is the LCD screen. Now, it's not unique in that um, respect, but it's a very nice feature and something which you can customise. They've got um, their inbuilt GIFs and their PNG files. Um, you can just select those or you can even import your own. You can customize it so you can um, show the CPU temperature. Um, so yeah, it's just a really nice touch. And then the, um, the RGB around the, uh, the pump head is also, also a very nice touch. Is it the best 240 millimeter AIO? I, I don't think it is, but I think it's up there. I think overall it's probably in the top three or four, um, but obviously it depends on you. You know, if, you, if you're kind of um, bought into the, uh, the ecosystem of ASUS, um, then definitely go for it. But I mean, obviously there's other options from NZXT, from Corsair, um, but this is, this is a very good choice. Um, and obviously with the, the fans that, um, that come with it being very good, I can't see why you wouldn't consider this, to be honest. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.